Good afternoon. One person is dead after a house fire in rural Noble County. News Channel 15 has confirmed that and much more new information since our overnight crew showed you the scene during First News. Drew Blair is live where it happened northwest of a villa. She continues our coverage now over the phone with what she has learned. Drew. Good afternoon, Pat and Tara. Firefighters are now into their ninth hour working this scene. The fire has been under control for several hours now, but crews are monitoring here and investigating what may have sparked it around 3.30 this morning. I talked to a Villa's fire chief who told me he could see flames from about three miles away. The house sits on a rural county road that isn't traveled much overnight. Firefighters say the fire may have burned for a half hour before they were even called to it. When they did get here, crews heard ammunition firing from the home. Flames ignited it and a large propane tank on the property. And crews had to cut through a locked gate at the front of the drive to even get to the house. They battled flames for two hours before the fire was considered under control. Uh, the fire chief couldn't tell me anything about the victim. A coroner will determine who died. The chief did say he believed a man lived here alone. It's too early for investigators to say what started the fire. The fire department says that may never be known due to the extent of the damage here. What used to be a two-story farmhouse is considered a total loss. We'll work to uncover more information as officials continue their investigation. You can look for the latest throughout the day on Wayne.com. Live in Noble County, Drew Blair, News Channel 15.